Hi guys, welcome back to D Diets. Please like and subscribe to the channel. Yesterday, me and my girlfriends went out. We were having a day of fun. Both of my girlfriends are 71 years old and I'm gonna be 61 years old. And one of my girlfriends lost her husband to Parkinson's two months ago. So we really dedicated the day to her. We wanted to go out, have some laughs, have a good time, three girls out and about, and we were going to lunch and we were gonna do a little shopping together. Well, we had a marvelous time. We went to Dress Barn, which I am gonna do a fashion show for you tomorrow. Yes, I am. And show you all the new shirts that I purchased. Oh, they had such a good sale. I can't believe that they're going out of business. But then we went to Marshall's and we went to the Outback for lunch and it was very, very nice. I had a grass-fed burger without the bun. I did. It did come with French fries. I had three. I don't have a gallbladder, so you have to be very, very careful if you don't have a gallbladder to uh, eat fried foods because you can still form stones in your uh, liver ducts, and that's a tremendous surgery that I choose not to have. So I really do watch what fried foods I put into my body. Well, then after we did all of this, the last stop we made was to Alta. Now, Alta is a beauty... Um, sells tons and tons of makeup, okay? All kinds of beauty accessories. Love this place. I've been in it many, many times with my daughter by myself. I love it. I just do. So I spoke to this one young woman, and they're all so young and beautiful. I don't have to tell you. The skin is flawless. Everything is gorgeous. And I said to her, I have puffiness under my eyes. Do you see this, girls, gentlemen? Because this goes for both men and women. So... I said, this is so puffy. There is not a stitch of makeup on my face. I know it's frightening, but there's not a stitch of makeup on my face. And I said, is there anything for the puffiness? And she said, yes. So I purchased, and I want you to know, this is what I purchased. Peter Thomas Roth's eye patches, okay? These are 24 karat gold um, patches that have a gel that's supposed to soothe, bring down... Um, the, the puffiness, the crow's feet. I don't care about the crow's feet because I, I just attribute those to laughing my ass off. I'll be honest with you. So if I get some crow's feet, it's, oh, let's see. You could see a little crow's feet there, a little crow's feet there. But if I get closer to the camera, you're going to see that there is already puffiness, you know, happening here. I, I did wash my face. I don't know, but this is it. This is it. So take a look at these eyeballs. So I figured what I was going to do is I'm going to open this up. I have not opened it yet, but I'm going to try this. Now, I want you to know this was $75. This is not cheap. It was $75. Maybe to some people that sounds cheap, but to me it didn't. But the girl was very nice, and she says, if it doesn't work, you have 30 days to bring it back, and we'll refund your money. So I went, well, how do you beat that deal? You really don't. So I can make an honest, I can really be honest on what I'm doing here. Because I don't want to lie to anybody and say something is nice if it's not nice. So it says here, it's in French, it's in so many languages. It says here, these ultimate luxurious anti-aging eye contour and gel patches are infused with 24 karat gold and uh, colloidal gold to help lift and firm the appearance of the delicate eye area in about 10 minutes. 10 minutes. Hello. Hello lavish and uh, pampering eye treatment. Well, this is be interesting. This will be interesting. So let's open the packaging. First of all, isn't that stunning? Look at the packaging. I love that. And, thumbnail. <laughs> um, oh, let's look. Let's see. Oh, it's all gold inside. Hello. There we go. Let's open this up. Oh, my goodness. Oh, okay. Here it is. Let's open it up. Oh, there's a little spatula in here. This is to grab, I guess, the... Because it doesn't come with any kind of instructions, does it? No, nope, nope, just does the same thing. So we're going to lift this. So you can see I didn't open this, guys. This is all new to me, too. Oh, my goodness. Oh, look. Look at them. Look at them. Let me smell it. Let's all smell together. Oh, it has a refreshing smell. Now, I'm assuming you dip this in, you grab one of these out. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. They're very moist. 
They're gold. I'm going to put it under my eye. Oh, it feels so good. Oh, it's got a lot of gel in there. Whatever's in there, it's got a lot of gel. Oh, wow. Ooh. You know that movie, James Bond, Goldfinger? <laughs> Maybe is that a little too close to my eyeball there? I don't know. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second here. I don't want to... Here we go. Oops. Right there. Okay. So we have this one in. I'm gonna, whatever gel is on here, girls, I'm going to spread under the eye. All right. So we got that one. Let's try another one on the other eye. I'm looking in here. And look at it in here. Oh my, oh wait a minute. You know, oh good, you know what girls? You know what girls, did I get two instead of one? I did, I did, I grabbed two. Let me just put that over here. Okay. Okay, oh, oh, oh boy, right to my eye. I know, oh. Okay, I have to say it's very soothing. It's very soothing. Ah, eh, what's it gonna hurt to put, put a little up? Maybe my hands won't be so swollen. Well, there is 60 patches in here. I'm just gonna close that up, airtight that thing, seal it, there we go. 60 patches, and what she said to me was, I don't use them all the time. Well, you know what, you're 20. So I just thought, okay. She says, but what you really have to do, she says, leave them on for 10 minutes and then take them off and then just put your makeup on like you normally would. So I said, okay, if it's gonna get rid of this puffiness and everything under my eyes, I'll be thrilled. So of course we're all gonna see this because I am gonna remove this and we're gonna see if it actually works. I just wanna get this up there. Oh my goodness, I'm gonna stab myself in the eyeball. There we go, there we go. Glamorous, just glamorous. Anyway, um, I thought it was a good deal only because I was able to return them if it really didn't work. But she did say to me, don't, you don't have to do this every day. She says, when you have some place to go and you're going out somewhere, there's our buddy. If you're going out somewhere and you just want to look refreshed, put those on before you put your makeup on. She said, just let them stay on for 10, 15 minutes and then uh, take it off, you know, wash your face, whatever you're going to do, and then apply your makeup like you normally would. So I said, oh, okay. Now, I can feel a little firming going on around here. I want you to know that. Now, I don't know if it's this stuff or I'm just, I'm just feeling it. I don't know yet. I'm excited, though, because I keep looking and going, is it going to change anyone? Oh, my goodness. You know, women of a certain age, we don't, it's not that I want to be 20 again. Because seriously, I don't think I'd want to be 20 in the 21st century today. I really mean that. Because it's so crazy. These young, these young girls... You know, everybody's striving for perfection. And let's be real, I'm not perfection at all. At all. But I'm not striving for perfection. I'm, I'm striving to maybe make myself a little healthier. But I'm not striving for, for perfection. It ain't gonna happen. But I just put it back in the box. You know, they're showing, you know, how to put them on. But really, it's quite obvious how to put them on. Now, the girl did say to me, you could leave them on for 10 minutes and then flip them. I said, okay. She goes, and then you could flip them and do it again and like, you know, use it all up on there. I went, okay. But it just keeps slipping. It's slipping. It could be me. It could be me. I don't know. There we go. Oh my goodness. I got to tell you, girls, this stuff, what's ever in here, it feels really good. They did say it has hydro, hydroonic acid. But, you know, it's not going to hurt my face. I know that. So, you know what? I'm going to let it sit for another seven minutes. Then I'll come back. Then we'll peel them off. And we'll see. And then I'll put my makeup on. I'll put my makeup on. So, we'll get to see with this on. And then with this off. And then me putting my makeup on. Because sometimes there's a difference, you know. If we put our makeup on and we do we do the look, even though my makeup is never a big look, it's it really seriously is not a big look. But I have to say we did have a really good time yesterday. I had so much fun. We had so much laughs. And you know when somebody passes, especially a husband, that 
it's awful tough. And she was taking care of him. He wasn't in a nursing home. So we did have a lot of laughs and it was needed. It was needed to sit and laugh and joke with one another. So then we went into Dress Barn. Like I said, I picked up seven different shirts, which I will fashion those for you. I will definitely put them on to show you. Again, I am not 20. So I have to find things that are going to look good on my body type. You know, nothing is where it used to be. I can tell you that right now. But I like these shirts that I, that I picked up. So I hope you guys like them too. And I'll show that to you in my next video. Oh my goodness. I do feel like, well, maybe I'm one of the Bond girls now. Cold finger. <laughs> All right, I'll be back. Let this thing do what it has to do, and then I'll remove them, and we'll see what it looks like underneath. Okay, 10 minutes is over. I left them on for probably 12 minutes, guys, because I was doing some stuff around the house. But I want to show you. Look, we're going to peel them off, and we're going to see what happens. I don't know if the camera's really showing it. Okay. You know, I have to say it's not as puffy, but I don't have my makeup on yet, so I have to really see how my makeup looks. It's definitely firmer. There's no doubt about it. Definitely firmer. I don't have a makeup light, but I can see a bit of a difference. Let me go put my makeup on, and then once I have my makeup on, I want to see how it's all going to look. You know, because you, you can't tell. I mean, I can tell. I see a little bit of a difference. I don't know if you guys can, but I can. And I think, I wish I that's just a dark circle. But I'm going to go put my makeup on, and maybe we'll see a difference then when the makeup is on. Oh, I'm very excited. It's definitely on the face, a little tacky. But I can say to you that it just, it does firm. It does firm. Oh gosh, just put it all over my whole entire body, whatever in these things. But I'm going to go wash my face and then I'm going to go put some makeup on and then I'll come back and we'll have the whole look. Don't expect glamorous, but I'm going to have the whole look and see what I would normally wear when I go out of the house. You know why I'm doing this is because I have contacts. I own contacts. And a lot of times when I go out to parties, I would like to put my contacts in, but I don't want all that dark circle and puffiness to be showing because glasses hide a lot. So I'm going to go in, do my look, and then I'll come back, and then we'll see what it looks like with all the makeup on. And believe me, I don't wear a lot of makeup, but I'll be back. Hey, I'm back. What do you think? Not bad. Now, I'll be honest with you, I still see a circle under the eye. I do. Uh, is it as puffy? No, but I only tried it one time. So maybe tomorrow I'll try it again for the next couple of days and see how it is. It's not that bad, though, honestly. But I wear glasses a lot. But it did firm up some of the skin on the side, which is always good. But this is the look. This would be my everyday going out to the grocery store, going out to lunch kind of look. And I never leave this house without makeup. Never. What is, what is on my arm? What is on my arm? I don't know what that is. I just looked at it in the ca... Oh, maybe, a bug, maybe I get bit by a bug. I don't know. Hey, it's not bothering me. But I never leave the house without makeup. I am the first girl to admit it. I don't do it. I always do at least an eye and a lip. And I love this lip color. Just so that you know, this is Jeffree Star's Liquid Lavore. And I love it, dream house, dream house, and a little gloss I put over it. But other than that, I do a really simple makeup look, and I have to say that this is not bad. Honestly, this is not bad. It's early in the morning, but this, I keep looking to see if I see anything different. But I do, I, it, it firmed up a little bit. I'm gonna see over the next couple of days if I see it any getting any better, and if it doesn't, guess what? That box is going back. But I will give it another day, or maybe tonight I'll sleep with them on, and I'll see how I look in the morning when I wake up, because that might be telling too. So maybe tonight I'll wear them, and I'll let you all know when I put out another video what, you know, what it looks like. Hmm. I thought it was quite fun, though, to be honest with you. I thought it was fun. All right. Now, I'm going to have the same look on, believe me, 
because I'm going to, I'm going to show you the clothes. I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to show you the clothes that I purchased at Dress Barn yesterday. And I'll do a video on that. But for now, I'm going to say goodbye. And then we'll have another video that's going to come out with all the new clothes that I purchased. And it's only a few shirts, but I want to show you. I thought they were very, very pretty. All right. Be kind to one another. That's really all that matters. I hope you enjoyed this uh, video. I know I enjoyed making it, to be honest with you, because it's not as puffy as it was. So I'll sleep with them tonight and I'll let you all know how it looked. I'll talk to you all soon, my friends. Take it easy.